Meanwhile... Tell me, Lieutenant, how do you really feel about humans? Well, I Honestly, don't sir, like them too I much. Obscene, foul, sickening, like the stuff in your eyes when you wake we, up. Um, like the wax he's speaking too fast for yeah. yeah. uh, yeah. so we have so we can talk a bit. We have some subtitle la lag here. Yeah. <laughs> this is the official subtitles too. I just so, no, I can't change the speed. Oh well, yeah, I've um I actually had some issues with the initial recordings of uh, Beneath the Steel Sky because trying to record in a certain format caused there to be audio lag so that like the, the subtitles didn't sync up with the voices and it was just a mess. Uh, well, I hope it's fixed. Oh yeah, it's totally fixed. Mine just worked off the bat because... because... Because you cheat. Absolutely. All day, every day. Okay, so now we have the club tentacle certificate, so now we can really distract the guy at the kennel, right? Yeah, we're gonna give give him the ten the, the tentacle. The ticket. And he's gonna go now, off. Remember how he was, he was hitting on Dinner us? He was hitting on us, right? Oh, he's gonna ask us out. No. I can't wait to tell <laughs> my wife. <laughs> oh, he's Whoops. married. <laughs> of course. Okay, so we want to unleash the humans so that the tentacle at the clock will leave. Free to do what? Uh, free to, huh? to Cause he has to wrangle them up again? The like you yeah, he'll should. run off and wrangle them so Big that we can get into the deal. clock. I said you're free, now right. get off your so fat, we can get back lazy down to butts and the, uh, start enjoying the, it. The basement Enjoy lab. Enjoy being hunted for the rest of our lives by that mustache <laughs> tentacle with a big net. If we ran off, he'd be right yeah, on that's our the point. Tail. If we stay here, we know we'll be warm and comfortable. Are you really comfortable Outside, on that bench, though? Bugs and mm. moss. You'll be eating my fist in wow. a second. Straight to the point. <laughs> this is why I like Laverne. <laughs> Lions, tigers, and bears, and skunks. Almost. Well, I hate skunks. Now, notice how much you hate skunks. Oh, mm. here I go out the door. Oh, I do so enjoy these freedoms <laughs> that my forefathers died for. Reverse psychology is not going to work. For. Give it up. Shh. <laughs> so we have to find a skunk. Yeah, we have to find a skunk. And failing finding a skunk, I suppose we could make one. That sounds... Now, what is, what is, what is the skunk? Oh, uh, it's a cat painted white. Exactly. Can't get close to him. Nailed this it. Ought to be good. <laughs> I've seen enough cartoons to know that. I remember you said that, by the way. <laughs> Why? <laughs> is that gonna come in? Well, yeah, maybe a little bit. Anyways, so now the cat's on the roof. Now, if only we had a way to get it down. Uh. Well, what do we have here? Looks like <laughs> I love this music loaded. theme. Wow, and that oh, another that smile. specimen. Oh, uh, gosh, so I think creepy. cats. So creepy. We're gonna show him the uh, skunk. The skunk. Hey, look, <laughs> a skunk. Dead air. <laughs> Not dead air. Of course. <laughs> yep. Come back here, That's definitely you humans. You it's definitely a this. classic this old cartoon facility. trope right there. And on that note, who says you can't learn anything from cartoons, <laughs> eh, kitty? Again. Nailed it. There, Again. You beat the game. You beat the game. <laughs> you beat the game to the punch, so we <laughs> like, that is calling you out on every single thing. Holy wow. Now, of course the benefit is that I'm getting these before the game is. So there's exactly. at least that. <laughs> it's the same generator that was in Dr. Fred's lab. I, I, will re I will reiterate right now. I have no exposure to this game prior to, like... Watching these this. to record these. Good riddance. <laughs> All right, yeah, so now that we're in well the basement, what are we doing? We're in the basement, so now we're switching to Bernard after I edit out that save. <laughs> Gross.
What is our, uh, our our primary goal at the particular moment? Well, to, for Laverne, she needs to get that generator running, and Weird yep. Ed Edison mentioned his hamster could do it. Decaf but wouldn't first, help there. First, I'm not so sure I that's a good idea. I fail at clicking. And we want to get into Dr. Fred's uh, safe. Uh -huh. So he only opens the safe when he's asleep. So if we give him decaf mm -hmm. instead of coffee... He'll start sleepwalking. <laughs> exactly. Oh, just immediately. Wow. Must open safe. <laughs> he hasn't slept in two years, so it kind of makes sense. Must <laughs> sign contract. Yeah, but I mean... Must provide for just family. Just like the, the, the... Decaf is not a, a counter... Like acting drug to caffeine. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. That doesn't seem like sleepwalking. That seems like possession, really. Well, yeah, but that's that's still not like I know it's in the name, but that's not how decaf works. So I come up here, and then I realize I forgot to actually go look at the safe. Did he actually open it? Oh. Well, he's actively opening it now. Uh huh. What somnambulistic disquiet he suffers. There's a contract in it. So if we try to pick up the contract... Yeah? Oh. He almost took my hand off with the door. There's a contract oh, in it. Oh, of course. <sighs> so this is the type of thing that would just stump me for the longest time. Well, you saw the camera in the room, right? Ew. We need that done, okay? Ew. <sighs> and the huh. gum re-entered. He didn't take it out of his mouth, but the gum and re-entered the inventory, so he's still <laughs> chewing it. That is... <sighs> no. Okay, Up too we late? want that sweater underneath them. Fingers fate. We do? Stick in a dime and you'll have a good time. Yeah, we do. Again, this is something that would have just stumped me for... Well, no, if, you, if you had looked around the room, you'd see put in a dime, have a good time. You'd put in a dime just for fun, because there's one easy to find. This and you'd notice him moving. Yeah. Uh, him. Still, this whole this whole sequence of puzzles would oh, just mind. be completely above me. At uh, now, there's like, it, it would take me probably an sleeper. hour to figure this stuff out. Well, it took me five years to finish the game, so you know. Ew, it's soaking wet. But I did start when I was four. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I'm talking about, like, right now. That's how oh. long it would take me. Well, this makes sense. Crowbar on candy machine, right? What doesn't make sense is what happens next. <laughs> <laughs> That's how it works, right? That's how many quarters you can stuff into one machine, right? And here's the he's OCD. Oh, God. He's very OCD. Oh, no. 1974. 1984. No. Oh, 1977. Well. <laughs> oh. How do they all fit in that? Is that... Does he have a quantum figure, singularity in his pants? $76,600 worth of quarters. Yes. Yes, he does. <laughs> That's the only way I could figure that would work. Also, is that um, is that the one of the characters from Sam and Max in that portrait there? It would be. It's even credited in the uh, even credited in the thing. Is, is it in the in the credits? In the credits? In the credits? I derped. I just forgot to pick this up by the You're way. You're brilliant. Doing what a novel uh -huh. design. Come to Baltimore at once. Now, remember how there was this one novelty designer who just wanted one person to like his uh, stuff? Uh, hey, there's yeah. a letter here for you. For me? <laughs> Probably another rejection slip. Oh, oh well. well. <laughs> Let me just trot on over there. You're brilliant. What a novel design. Come to Baltimore at once. Dot, dot, dot. <laughs> <laughs> And, and now, now we, we don't can... have to duck under the chain. We can yeah. get that flag gum. Seriously, though. Yeah, we... he, can't, he can't commit suicide anymore. We could have just gone under the chain, though. Oh, eh, whatever. Yeah, oh well. So what, are we... what do we need the novelty gun for? Okay, well first, 
Oh, we'll ask later, but first we need to see the camera, but Edna won't let us near her stuff, so let's push her out of the room. Nah, that doesn't work yet. Yeah. <sighs> She's grabbing onto the sword, if only he was holding the sword in his other hand. Oh, uh, so we have to switch the brothers? Exactly. <laughs> you solved it faster than I did. <laughs> <laughs> now, this is a very easy... I just I did solve this puzzle by accident the first time, because it's like, well, I have a left-handed hammer. I wonder what this will do. Yeah. We're, we're just swapping his hammer. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> and now you can't oh, use no. it. I'm not sure that's how it works. I've lost it. Well, you didn't invent it. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, where hath gone the muse that once guided my hand with such care? Must inspiration be so transitory? <sighs> Must art be so cruel? Now, admittedly. Ooh. <laughs> I'm a failure. I've, I've tried writing Don't with my right man. hand before, and Father that's about right. how well it goes. We so. are yeah, that's what happens when I do it with my left hand. Not <laughs> Except worse. Because even my Dear right hand mother, writing is pretty terrible. We must be strong in these times of creative adversity. My signature looks like it was Why written by someone who was six because I learned how to do it when I was six and I never changed. Oh, well, I mean, signatures are not... Have, a cappuccino. Like, ha have you not seen doctor signatures before? Dude, I work in I'm a retail store. Places. I see signatures all the time that exactly. are literally... Like, I think you're coming out quite know. well. Some, They're not some even them, lines. Yeah, They're some like of them are actually just scribbles. Yeah. I take pride in that I actually like use real letters, and yeah. I can even do it in Cyrillic. <laughs> well, and my you Cyrillic had to... one is so much better than my English one. That's kind of scary, but okay. Anyway, speaking of scary, let's get rid of Edna. Oh. Uh. Well, you know what they say. If you want to save the world, you gotta push <laughs> a few old ladies down the stairs. I've never heard anyone say that before. I have actually. Have you really? I actually have. Uh, I'm horrified too. That I'm not sure I ever wanted. Well, I like the the fisheye lens they got going on there. Did fish in the rest of the game and click the wrong button. Sorry. <laughs> so we are recording the uh... recording him doing it, so that we have yeah, the combination. Yeah, see, we're recording now. Are we going to have to, like, slow it down or something? Dr. Brad Edison. Yes. <laughs> Internal revenue. <laughs> Come with us. Well, this is a twist. We'd like to go over some of your records with you. <laughs> Upstairs. But he's asleep. Well. Well, um. <laughs> got him out of the room? Uh, uh... Super slow mo. I have no idea why EP is the slow motion setting, but there you go. Um, yeah, you, you got me. All right, do we have to actually manually put in the no. animation? No, now that we've seen it, Bernard remembers it. All right. At least it gives us that kind of small grace. Doctor Brad Edison. <laughs> This cannot be skipped. Internal <laughs> revenue. Come with. I like how us. the subtitles are in slow motion as well. It, it leaves out the last bit of it, which is okay. Yeah. I think I broke the button. Oh no. Hopefully Edna doesn't notice. Anyways, let's go talk to. IRS. Is that a W three ninety B frivolous spending report? <laughs> oh, oh no. No, it's another five sixty one A B negative attention statement. And they have the What is it? They're twins. What have you done with Dr. Fred? We've got him safely locked in the next room while we go over his books. Locked? Are you allowed no, to No, you can't go in and see him. him. Yeah. And don't even think about staging some kind of rescue. I mean uh, if you have to see what they've done to him, I think that's the least along. the problems. Keep yeah. your nose clean, kid. I don't think we care enough to stage a rescue, though. Is that though. a W390B for a No, we kind of need Dr. Fred. Nah. 
But we need him to sign a contract. Nah. We got the safe combination. That's surely all we need. But the contract's in the safe. By the way. I'm sorry to do this to you, little fella, but it's for the future of the whole planet. <laughs> Remember how I said you can only flush, like, items and not living things through the Carnageon? So we are <laughs> freezing the hamster. We are freezing the hamster. Ah. <sighs> Don't worry, that's the le less disturbing thing that's going to happen to that poor hamster. It's not going to get shattered into a million pieces, is it? No, that would not be Let's see, uh, it's Maniac 101 Mansion. <laughs> is, is it going to have its head bitten off? It will not have its head bitten off. <laughs> okay, so at least we don't, the first we don't end up going on the hereby be known as... A crazed maniacal genius. Do you actually want a contract to recognize you as that, though? Well, you are when you uh, know, like call yourself a mad scientist. <sighs> okay, so... Also, uh, <clears throat> there's no point in flushing the sweater to Laverne. Yeah. Uh, there's another way that we can send it through time to Laverne. Notice how a quarter will last 30 minutes in this thing. We have almost a million dollars in quarters. Now, I'm pretty sure, much, much later, Whew. I'm pretty sure that uh, that's not how coin-operated laundry machines work. Shush. <laughs> Source being the coin-operated laundry machine in my apartment complex. Shush. <laughs> okay, so we are endlessly washing the sweater. And now we are staging a rescue. Exactly. And yeah, some... they locked him up, but they wrapped him up in so much uh, non-metaphorical red tape that you know, he can't move anyways. <laughs> red tape, yeah. He's caught up in the red tape. Uh-oh. Hey. Where'd he go? <laughs> ah, there you I'm are. I'm so glad that they are just complete monotone There's no well. escape from the IRS. Well... It is the IRS. Yeah. Okay, so we have to have a way to uh, replace him, so in a way that, you know... The mummy. Yeah, so we're about to enter weekend at Bernie's territory. <laughs> <laughs> May I remind you that I was playing this when I was four years old? <laughs> I didn't get to this part till I was like six, but still. No. I didn't... <sighs> And we're gonna paint him red. Ted is red. See, red Ted. <laughs> no! Why? And now this is also way more disturbing now that I'm an adult. Oh, wow. You're gonna... Oh, no. Oh, honey, no. That's... <laughs> <sighs> My goal, get you to say, oh, honey, no, at least once per game. <laughs> Remember when the emerald was stolen? What? No. Not at all. Well, uh, Purple Tentacle stole it, but now he's returned it, and now everyone likes him, and you might see how this is a problem. Oh, that's his sinister plan. Become liked, and then take over the world, yeah. It's, it's his I'm not evil gonna plan. Wander, I'm not gonna wander around aimlessly any, uh, enough to see the next part, so that's the best we're gonna see. It's... Uh, oh. Oh. Yeah, this is way more disturbing than they... 22. <laughs> Uh. Mom, why did you well, let me do this? Yeah, uh, that's just wow. Okay. So. I mean, I'm I'm so glad that I I'm I'm so glad that I can actually kind of see the most of the logical progressions to solving these puzzles. Yeah, that's why this game is well liked. <laughs> I, I I would still get wildly confused by the inventory switching, but you know. Ugh. What I love here is now he's there. Mm, thought I heard something. Yeah. Everything okay in there? And now he responds with the okay sign in his hand. Well, try and keep it down, okay? <laughs> and they're okay with that. Well, sure. It was. Just his hand? <laughs> okay, so... 
This is also a little bit disturbing because we can't see what's going on. <laughs> now, are you ready for the stupidest line in the game? This is the stupidest line in the whole game. He's had quite a few stupid oh, no. lines already. Nah, I'm not going to make that mistake again. So he does this instead. See if he can detect the problem. <laughs> Ow. Oh. <laughs> this is happening right now. Crash. Oof. Dr. Fred, are you okay? Okay. There's no Dr. way this Fred? would have been survivable. I'd better get him to the lab. <laughs> well, I got him in here, but he's out cold. <laughs> Thankfully, there's a way to make him wake up. Let's keep him awake for coffee. two years. That is some, like... He, he created that coffee, like, special plant, didn't he? Well, Bernard did say he could oil his car with it, so... Yeah. It's, uh, it's, it's like, it's his... I like how Bernard's ducking. It's his spinach, you know. Damn good coffee! This gets him raring to go. Alright, so... That was damn good coffee. Okay, so now we can actually finish off Laverne. I feel because... like... Hmm? I feel like, uh, painting the mummy red should make it red in the future. Looks yeah. like there's some kind of rodent down there. Maybe paint wears off? I don't know. <laughs> Anyways. Uh, time travel. So she shoves <laughs> it down her bra. Yeah. You know, that's <laughs> totally comfortable right now. Well, yeah, remember how I was. Solid. Remember how I was saying, like in the first game, you could, like, it was canonical that you microwaved uh, the guy's hamster? <laughs> well, we have the guy's hamster again. What do you think we're gonna do with it? Oh. <laughs> Gosh, I hope this isn't like the primitive, <laughs> dangerous microwave ovens of my. No, it's today. even worse. Those things could really pop a <laughs> hamster good. <laughs> oh gosh. Uh oh. You, you could turn the microwave off. You know. Well, it's okay. It survived. Now, are you ready for the best meta line in gaming? Because we're about to get the best metal line in That was fun, but only because this is the 22nd century. <laughs> you see, kids who put hamsters in microwaves back where I'm from get taken away from their parents and put up for adoption. <laughs> so don't do it. <laughs> so anyways, the hamster is still cold somehow. <laughs> but, so, however, we have a tiny little uh, sweater, sweater to put on it. Cute. What? <sighs> it shrunk to doll size. This ought to warm him up. <laughs> to be fair, that happens after like five hours, not like two hundred years. Uh. Source. I used to be very terrible at laundry. Yeah. I like how the dryer was still running as well. Now, this is annoying. Suck. There's just one extra puzzle, because they did need at least one more. Puzzle. No, of course. But, you know, at least we got to punch Laverne in the face, and she's kind of okay with it. I don't know, she looked pretty mad to me. So anyways, the hamster is now in a, uh... In a mouse hole. In a mouse hole. How would you get something out of a mouse hole? Oh, so this is where the... Me noticing the mouse holes earlier... No... No, no, that's gonna come in handy even later. Oh, How do you get something out of a mouse hole, though? Um, with cheese. No. A vacuum cleaner. <clears throat> oh, Boy, of it's course. Boy, sure quiet in here. I wonder if there might be any ideas worth discussing <laughs> in the suggestion box. Very subtle. Maybe somebody should take a look. Nah. I say, lads, I have an idea. We should look at the suggestion box. Does it have anything to, to, to do with starting a fire? No. I was thinking it's about time we open the suggestion yeah. box. Don't you agree? <laughs> sure, George, if you say so. Yes, whatever you think is fine with us. Excellent. 
What did we actually put in the thinking? suggestion It was box. a flyer from George's Hardware saying what every... it says this. Box. Perhaps he intends to suggest something himself. We're gonna oh. trick George Washington into oh. thinking he's smart. Here's a suggestion. Uh -huh. It says, George says that every American should have a vacuum cleaner in their basement. What do you think, gentlemen? <laughs> dot, dot, dot. What's a vacuum cleaner? Mm, whatever you say, George. <laughs> Your name's on Your it. Your name's on I'm it, oh. I'm sure you must have a good reason for suggesting it. Yes. It's strange. I don't quite... Well, I'm sure I had a reason for it. If there are no objections, we <laughs> shall add it to the Constitution immediately. Yeah. I could see that being a... No? Good. And so shall it be of... law. I could see that being part of the American Constitution. What's a vacuum Yeah, queen? there we go. <laughs> there we Delayed, go. <laughs> but they did think of it. <laughs> and that's how we got a vacuum cleaner in the basement to get the hamster back with. <laughs> Say nothing about it, okay? <laughs> you just said something. Shush! <laughs> you suck. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways. Okay, so we have to suck the hamster out of the mouse hole. <laughs> yes. With that smile on our face, because Laverne is secretly actually a sociopath. <laughs> <laughs> she, she really enjoyed that. And do we have an easy way? Okay, so we can just pull it out. Yeah, that's fine. Are we going to get socked in the face by that boxing glove? Oh, that's a dirty hamster. Are we going to get socked in the face by the boxing glove again? There's a face print on the glove. I hope it's sprung for good. <laughs> it yeah. is sprung for good. <laughs> well? Look at that sucker go! He just keeps running and He's like running the and bunny. running. So we finally got the generator on. Mm -hmm. Now what? Now we go plug in our chronogen and the burn is done. <laughs> Yay! I I'm a little bit disappointed we didn't get to see your hands out walking the animation a bit more, but you know. Oh well. Mm -hmm. uh, and yeah. that's all we got time for for this video.